It's tamale season, and instead of using lard, we used oil to make these tamales because it's lower in saturated fat. We start off by seasoning our water and cutting up our chicken breast to throw it into water and bring it to a boil. And since that's gonna take a minute to cook, we're gonna go ahead and put our corn husk in water and weigh it down with a pot and water in it. Next, we have our masa, and like I said before, we are opting to use oil instead of lard this time. I promise it's still gonna be good. Then we took some water from the chicken that was cooking, threw it in a blender, and added it to our masa to add some more flavor. Now you throw everything into the mixer and make sure it blends together to the textures kind of like dough. Now that our chicken is ready, we're going to take it out, and since it's so tender, it falls apart super easily. This next step is totally optional, but we got salsa, blended it up, and added it to our chicken for more seasoning and flavor. Time for the final step. We added our masa to our corn husk, spread it out, added the chicken into it, and wrapped it, which is a lot harder than it looks. From here, you basically just repeat this process over and over until you have the amount of tamales that you want. So here are the tamales that we made, and we are going to go ahead and steam them. We put foil in the middle to help them stand up so they wouldn't fall over, and once the tamales look like this, then they're ready to be eaten. We decided I top off these tamales with some power slot to get a little bit more fiber in our diet. And now we can enjoy.